टुडे वी आर प्रिपेयरिंग कॉटेज चीज करी विद बटर नान कॉटेज चीज इज नोन एज पनीर ऑल्सो आई जस्ट टेल यू द इंग्रेडिएंट्स आई हैव टेकन 200 ग्राम्स ऑफ पनीर 5 5 टू 7 क्लोव्स ऑफ गार्लिक स्मॉल पीसेस ऑफ जिंजर 2 अनियन 3 टमेटोस कैशियो नट्स एंड गरम मसाला कोरिएंडर पाउडर क्यूमिन सीड्स सॉल्ट वेज करी मसाला एंड चिली फॉर मेकिंग द डो आई जस्ट टेल यू आई हैव टेकन 2 कप्स ऑफ रिफाइंड फ्लावर व्हाट आई विल डू आई विल ऐड इन अ वॉर्म वाटर 1 स्पून 1 वेरी स्मॉल स्पून ऑफ ईस्ट एंड 1 स्पून ऑफ शुगर now what we'll do we'll just mix this this is in a warm water we'll just mix it and just put the lid on on it just let it get fermented in then we'll mix it in our dough and make it a dough of it for that we for dough we require milk also i'll just tell you when i'll make the dough how to put the milk now we'll make our dough first we'll put that yeast and sugar mixture and just mix it very nicely in the dough see all our yeast is mixed nicely now what we'll do at this time we'll add slowly slowly our milk and we'll make a nice dough of it our dough is ready now what we'll do we'll just cover it and keep it for half an hour till our dough is getting ready we'll prepare our cottage cheese curry for that we'll just put the oil 3 to 4 tablespoons of oil i have chopped the onions in a long size i have chopped the onion in a long size like this and the tomatoes also and we have chopped our garlic garlic and ginger both now first step we'll just put our cumin seeds then our ginger garlic Now goes our onion. We'll just fry our onion to 50 percent. We'll just not fry them golden brown. We are not going to make golden brown. We'll just leave it 50 percent fry. Now we'll add our cashew nuts. Let them also get fried along with onion. At this stage we will add our tomatoes. We can see our onions like this. Now we'll close our tomatoes. Now we'll add our salt. Half a spoon of salt. And just mix it. Now, now we'll add water. One glass of water. After adding the water, we will just cover it and let it cook for five to ten, five to six minutes. We'll just check and see. Now our onions, tomatoes, and cashews are almost boiled and cooked. At this time, we'll just switch off the gas and we'll put this all in a blender and grind it. Now it's cooled down, we'll just put it in the blender. Once it's grind, we'll just take a strainer and just strain all this. We'll just do it like this. See, now it's done. Our puree is ready. In the same pan, we'll just add one spoon of oil and 
butter. Now we'll add our in rest of the ingredients one by one once the butter is melted. Now at this time we have to keep the gas in same and one by one put our all our ingredients. Here goes coriander powder one spoon, homemade garam masala half spoon, chili powder half a spoon, curry masala less than half a spoon. Salt we have already put so we are not going to add salt. Now we will mix all this ingredients. Once it is mixed we will add a turmeric powder. Here goes our turmeric powder. Now we will add a puree. And once it comes to a boil, we will just add a cottage cheese paneer. And just let it boil for about for a minute, not much. Because it's already cooked, the gravy. Let it get cooked. Our cottage cheese curry is ready. We will just garnish with coriander and switch off the gas. Now, our dough is fermented so nicely. Now, we will prepare our naan. We will just add little oil in our fingers and we will just take out small amount of and make it a round bowl like this. We will add dry flour in it and we will start rolling it gently. Like this. In a long shape. You can see our naan is ready. We are not making it in any tandoor or oven. We are making it in tawa. Just normal tawa. Normal. Now what we will do with this? We will just put the water like this. Nicely. Just all over. It is very tasty and cooked very nicely. After putting water applying we will just put some stick some coriander leaves now what we'll do we we'll just stick this like this and let it get cooked now we, what we'll do we will just flip it this way and let it get cooked from the other side See our naan is getting cooked so nicely. Just have to just roll, keep rolling it so the heat goes everywhere. Now we will just check it from the other side. As you can see it's cooked so nicely. See we will make other naan also like this. You can see. Now again we will just spread water nicely in all naan and add our coriander leaves same way. Our other naan is getting cooked. 
same way we will do for this also. We will just, you can see, it is getting cooked. See, like this you have to just cook from all the corners. It is very easy to make naan this way and trust me it is very very tasty. I'll just flip it and check to the other side. See how beautifully it's done. So I'm showing you both the side of the naan. This is the front side and this is the back side. Now we, what we'll do, we'll just add butter in it. We'll add butter. And serve it. Now we'll do the plate. Our cottage cheese curry and butter naan is ready to eat. Please try my recipe and if you like my recipe, please subscribe my channel, comment and share. Thanks for watching.